subscribe to our channel, and hit the bell icon, to never miss a video from us. Azure Active Directory Azure Active Directory, Azure AD, is Microsoft's cloud-based identity and access management service. It simplifies authentication for developers by providing identity as a service. It supports industry standard protocols. Azure AD allows users to sign in, and view resources and it has features to help secure your identities, such as identity protection, and multi-factor authentication. Microsoft services such as Azure and Office 365 use Azure AD to store and manage users. Whenever Office 365 needs to verify a user, for example, Azure AD performs all identity and access management. The employees can sign in and access resources such as external resources, such as Microsoft Office 365, the Azure portal, and thousands of other SaaS applications. Internal resources, such as apps on your corporate network and intranet, along with any cloud apps developed by your own organization. Azure AD is not a cloud version of Windows Server Active Directory. It's also not intended as a complete replacement for an on-premises Active Directory. If you are already using a Windows AD server, you can connect it to Azure AD to extend your directory into Azure. Azure AD can also be used independently of Windows AD. Microsoft offers several cloud-based offerings today, all of which can use Azure AD to identify users and control access. Subscriptions in Azure are both a billing entity and a security boundary. Resources such as virtual machines, websites, and databases are always associated to a single subscription. Each subscription also has a single account owner who is responsible for any charges incurred by resources in that subscription. If your organization wants the subscription to be billed to another account, you can transfer ownership of the subscription. A given subscription is also associated to a single Azure AD directory. Multiple subscriptions can trust the same directory, but a subscription can only trust one directory. Users and groups can be added to multiple subscriptions, this allows the user to create, control, and access resources in the subscription. When you add a user to a subscription, the user must be known to the associated directory as shown in the image. Companies that use an on-premise Windows Server Active Directory solution can integrate their existing users and groups with Azure Active Directory with Azure AD Connect. This is a free tool you can download and install to synchronize your local AD with your Azure Directory. With Azure AD Connect, you can provide your users with a common identity for Office 365, Azure, and SaaS applications integrated with Azure AD in a hybrid identity environment. Azure AD Connect provides several components that you can install to create a hybrid identity system. Create an Azure AD Tenant To start, you'll use the Azure Portal to create a new Azure AD Tenant. 1. Go to the Azure Portal. 2. On the Azure Portal menu or from the home page, select Create a Resource. 3. Select the Identity category, and then select Azure Active Directory. 4. Fill in the Create Directory page with these values, and then select Create. 5. When directory creation is complete, select Click here to manage your new directory. Next, let's create a new registration in the Azure AD tenant, for the web application. By registering the application, we mark the app as trusted by the tenant, and specify critical configuration values. 1. On the Azure Active Directory page, under Manage, select App Registrations. 2. In the App Registrations pane, select New Registration. 3. Fill in the Create page with these values, and then select Register. 4. In the next page, note the Application ID and Directory ID values, and record them for later. You'll need these to complete the configuration file for this project. You've now configured the Azure AD tenant, and perform the initial application registration to enable your application to communicate with your Azure AD tenant. For more such videos, subscribe to our channel.